Today was one of the hardest and busiest days this year so far in the search and rescue area in front of Libya. During the first mission we flew with Moonbird, we already spotted one empty white rubber boat where we don't know the fate of the people. During the second mission we learned of a wooden boat that was in distress in the east. While we were searching for that boat we found another white rubber boat with over 80 people on board. Um, it was still moving but it was not in a good condition. The hardest fact about today though was that there were four other aircraft in the area with us, all deployed by the European Union, while there was not a single rescue ship by the EU. Instead, all these aircraft were just trying to get the Libyans to deport these people back to Libya as fast as they can, where they face incredible horrors. We're asking how is it possible that the MRCC in Rome did not inform the one rescue ship of an NGO that is down there, the Marionio, about these cases and ask them to help and actually save these people. How is that possible that the EU is funding all these aerial surveillance missions and not actually sending rescue ships down there, but instead blocking our ships 